Hello guys, this is Paul Oscar from Laravel Daily Team and Laravel Daily Video. I apologize for my shaky voice this morning, I'm a little sick, but still want to shoot this video, quick video, and it will be less technical, less Laravel specific and more motivational. But first, I decided that in the videos I will share some links to useful tools or tips or articles. So the first one will be my own uh, mini course written like a month ago how to create admin panel in Laravel 5.4. So you will find the link in the YouTube description below. Um, please check that out and I hope it will be useful for you. And topic of the day is are you a factory worker or a doctor? What do I mean by that? Imagine you have a new client, uh, Laravel specific or not Laravel specific, it doesn't matter that much. Uh, basically there are two types of clients. Uh, one, types of client, one type of client is when they come to you specifically knowing what they need. So they come with uh, specific technical knowledge, they know they need Laravel for example, and this database and this server, and they have technical specification, they have all the details, and they just hire you to write the code. Uh, they hire you just like a pair of hands basically. Uh, not, not, not so much the brain, but the hands and that is quite a bad position to be in. Then you are kind of a factory worker and uh, similar workers, there are a lot of them. There's a fierce competition for just writing code and the price tag is lower and you probably won't earn that much. So, uh, and, uh, and like the factory, the, there's not much thinking in there. The whole machine is already kind of running with all the process and you just need to, to work as, as factory rules. On the other side of the coin, there are doctors. What do I mean, I mean by doctors? When a client uh, comes to you, like the doctor, the, the expert, and you position yourself as an expert in the field, they come kind of blindly. They come trusting you to make the decisions on what they actually need. So they, uh, they phrase their problem, they, they sp tell specifically what website they need, what idea they have, and then you first consult them on what they actually need. No, first you ask questions about why do they need it, what, what are the goals and stuff like that. Then you consult them on what they actually need. Then together you decide the plan on what are you're actually building, and then you go write the code, or even your team writes the code. Uh, if you have a team. So in this case, you are a consultant, an expert, kind of like a doctor in like private practice. If you go to a dentist, you don't tell the dentist what, what to do. You, you might have read an article or two, but, uh, but still. Uh, and then you value dentists more and you pay more exactly. Uh, so, so think on, uh, on which side of the coin are you? Are you just writing the code or are you consulting your clients and try to be on the second, in, in the second group and it will bring you more money, more valuable customers and uh, more reputation in the long run, which will basically build your business more and more. So just, uh, I guess, don't agree uh, on, on the projects which you are, where you are just a pair of hands. Unless you need money, that's totally fine. In the beginning of the career, we all come through that. But try to be a consultant, an expert, and imagine yourself as a doctor that solves the pain uh, more than a factory worker. Hope that helps, and see you in the next videos on the Laravel Daily Channel.